Today I'd like to show you how to build a mosquito killer uh, made out of products that we can find here in Niger. Some cans, some rags, a transformer, a light from an old car, a rubber band, and a fan from an old computer, and the only tool you're going to need is a knife. First thing you're going to do is make holes big enough for a mosquito to get into. You'll notice that the light, the fan, and the power source all have two wires. Just attach one to one side, one to the other side. It actually doesn't matter which way you connect them. Next, you're going to attach the power. Just make sure everything works. It's a lot easier to change a fan or a light now before you install it, so make sure everything works before you proceed. So now you need to un disconnect the wires of the electrical plug, put them through one of the holes, and then reattach them. So uh, it's important to tie a knot here to keep the wire from pulling out and unattaching that. Now you're going to put the fan in and if you've chosen the can well, you can just slide it in there and it'll stay in place. You need to make sure that it's blowing away from these little holes here. And now you're just going to fill up these holes on the edges of the fan with a rag or some paper towels. So now you can see that the fan is well um, stabilized in there and the mosquitoes can't escape by going around the fan. So now the last step is to attach the light to the top of the lid. You can see I chose an elastic band but that'll depend a little bit on your can how you want to attach that on top. So the last step is to attach a piece of fabric here on the bottom with an elastic band. So now we can attach uh, the electricity and see if it works and we can see that it does. At this point you're going to just want to tip it over and make sure that the air is definitely blowing out through the cloth on the bottom and away from the holes on the top. And this is just going to ensure that the mosquitoes do get sucked in there. The final step is the most important. You need to get some baking soda and vinegar. And you could dilute this with water if you want to make it lower, uh, make it a slower burn. Um, when these two mix together, what they're going to produce is carbon dioxide. And mosquitoes are attracted by the carbon dioxide. And that's going to be the most powerful way that you'll attract them to uh, this trap so that they'll be sucked in. So the point of this project is to make a bug sucker like this that attracts the mosquitoes with carbon dioxide and light and then pushes them in the bottom where they, they're dehydrated and they die. And last night I caught 43 mosquitoes in my living room. And I hope that you make one and kill mosquitoes too. Have fun.